Crash punched it, we got two back. The guy in the rear with Ben around for the uh, commander call for it. I see he's being real safe there. He might have caught a little something down there. If you leave a, something burning down there and you stick the new round in there, it will go off and take your hand off. Boom! That's right. In a night fire, there'll a cone of fire come out in front of it, about to where those dead palmettos are. And there'll a cone of fire come out of the torch hole about 20 feet high. So you definitely do not want to stand over the cannon. That's why the number three man is in the dealing position. So if it does go off, it won't take his face with it. Number one man is inserted the round, brought it home. Number three man would prick it, what he calls. He takes the brick and opens the charge up, puts the firing uh, cap on it. He has to be definitely sure that he gets powder there. He has to know that there's powder there. He must have got a good reading. There he is. Fire in the hole! Cover up. Fire! Two ounces of powder. Could you imagine, imagine what one full pound of powder would sound like? It will pick the cannon up about two feet and roll it back about six. Can you imagine a hundred of them sitting in a line fire? We've had the privilege of doing 30 of them. And it's, it's really awesome. Smoker gets a thick you can't see. We really appreciate everyone coming out. I think it's a great thing what the park 